Hi guys, David from Infusion Video. I just wanted to share this video with you showing you how you can record your iPhone screen using ScreenFlow and QuickTime. Now a while back, you were able to record your desktop, but never your iPhone screen. So thanks to ScreenFlow and QuickTime, we can now do that. So let's head over to the computer. Let me show you how I can do that. Okay, we're over here on our desktop. So first we're gonna to wanna to plug in our iPhone. So once that is plugged in, our Mac should de detect that we plugged in our iPhone and then we can open up ScreenFlow and go into the menu. See here, we got a little camera and then normally here is where you would hit uh, your start recording. But since I'm already using ScreenFlow as we speak, um, we're just going to go up to the file menu and go to new. So you have the same pop up um, and you have all these different uh, selections you can pick from. Uh, so I can record my desktop from my iMac and then right here, um, make sure you have that selected record screen from and then select your iPhone. So, I mean, this is going to work the same if you have an iPad, um, but right now I'm using my iPhone, so I have that selected, and then you just hit record, um, and make sure you have uh, selected a microphone. So now that we're we're already recording, if I pick up my iPhone, um, oh, and just so you know, whenever you hit record, you're not going to see your iPhone on your screen. Um, it's just going to you're going to use your iPhone like normal. And then after it's done recording, then you go back in, you'll see that uh, the screen capture uh, software actually pulled your iPhone. So, so we can just go through, I'm just scrolling through my phone, just like normal. And you can see that on the screen right now. And if we wanted to show somebody how to use uh, Snapchat, we can just open up any application uh, like we would normally do and then I can just swipe through Snapchat showing them uh, how I want to use it or how to use Snapchat I can just close out of that and say I wanted to show somebody how to use uh, YouTube creating a channel or scrolling through your channel on your phone uh, you can do that just like normal so that is really all you need to do to uh, screen record your iPhone. So that is for ScreenFlow. Now let's head over to QuickTime just to show you how to do that as well if you don't have ScreenFlow. So I'm going to open up Spotlight and just type in QuickTime. Okay. Now it's a little different than ScreenFlow. It actually shows you the screen right on your desktop. And we're going to hit done. We don't need that window. We'll go back up to the file menu, QuickTime. And then we're going to go to new movie recording. And then you can see it's opening up. There's my phone. And then if I want to, like see right here, right next to the record button, there's a little drop down. So if you don't see your phone, it's either you don't have it plugged in or the camera is selected is your built-in eyesight. So you just want to switch over to your iPhone. Once that's ready and you're, you've picked your microphone, then you can just go ahead and hit record. It'll start recording. And then just like before, on ScreenFlow, you can just I can just swipe through my phone, but I am seeing in real time on my desktop. So, like I said, I can just go into Snapchat and I can just scroll through, uh, showing somebody how to use Snapchat if I wanted to, or any any application on your phone. And then once you are done re recording what you needed on your phone, then just hit stop. It's going to create the file here, and then you just go up to your menu and go to File, 
and then you can export it as any file type that you want 1080p 720 480 and then uh, you're good to go so that's it that's all you need to do to record your screen on your iPhone for screen flow and QuickTime so if you are using some software to record your screen go ahead and put it in the comments below and also if anybody has any questions please leave them in the comments below and I'll try to answer them as soon as possible and we will see you guys in the next one